Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a tricky issue that many developers encounter when working with Spring Boot and Thymeleaf behind a reverse proxy. Our viewer has a question about how to correctly form relative URLs in their Thymeleaf templates when using Nginx as a reverse proxy. Let's dive into the details. Okay, we're back with another tech video. Now I'm gonna go through your question, answer it, and hopefully you get the solution. Now remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me and you'll get there to that resolution. All right, let's continue on to the video. To address the issue of Timeleaf not forming the correct URLs behind a reverse proxy, we need to understand how the reverse proxy interacts with our Spring Boot application. First, let's look at the Nginx configuration. You have a location block that proxies requests to your Spring Boot application. This is a good start, but we need to ensure that the context path is correctly passed to Timely. Next, we need to modify the Nginx configuration to include the correct headers. Specifically, we should add the X-forwarded prefix header to inform the application about the base path. Now, in your Spring Boot application, you need to ensure that it recognizes this header. You can do this by adding a configuration property in your application properties file. With these changes, Timeleaf should now generate the correct URLs, allowing your CSS and other resources to load properly. Test your application by accessing it through the reverse proxy. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To resolve URL issues in a Spring Boot application behind a reverse proxy, you need to inform the application that it's behind a proxy. Extend your Nginx config with specific proxy headers to ensure correct URL formation. For more information, check the Nginx documentation on forwarded headers and explore related GitHub issues for additional insights. You can test your Spring Boot app locally using CURL to simulate proxy request headers without needing Nginx. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the URL issue with Thymeleaf templates behind a reverse proxy, the user matched the Tomcat server context to the Nginx location. They set the context to slash app. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one.